We will begin the show today from Nollywood, where super actor Jim Ike reunites with Bad Comment director for a new movie titled Sin. After scoring an impressive cinema run with Bad Comment, the duo are back at it and they share details on the new movie, including a scoop that a follow up to Bad Comment is in the offing. Take a look. Are you going to sit down for me? Yes. A second. Yes. I'm sorry, sir. I'm sorry. Don't do that. Don't do that. Don't do that. Stress it. You don't want to do that. Now, I, 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 I want to apologize if I do your hope. You apologize. You apologize. You apologize. Yes. Sit the fuck down! Yes. Unlike anything that's been portrayed on our side of the divide, everybody has always been careful when they approach the art of filmmaking. Um, for me, it's not the craftsmanship that everybody has abided to. It's that term that's been conventional. For me, um, filmmaking is an art. And if you're not dealing with socioeconomic or sociopolitical issues, then I think um, somehow I felt personally that um, the, the mantle of um, this gift um, has been lost on me. It was very important for me that I delve into a portray certain you know, issues in our, our society, um, in our culture, especially that I think I could export to the world outside. Um, there's certain controversial subjects that's already prevalent in the world. Um, in the likes of, um, for instance, bad comment where we delved into the um, so, um, ecosystem of social media. The drug problem in Nigeria, as well know, has become quite an issue. It's become what it is, um, an epidemic of sorts, of unimaginable proportion, if we don't begin to delve into it. I decided to visit that subject. It's a very delicate subject. Everyone is always um, profoundly sensitive about it. Um, that's what sin is about how this has eaten into the fabric of our community, um, how it has eaten into the fabric of our youth element, um, of our GDP even. Um, the untold stories of so many people that are, that are hooked on drugs that um, have not yet found the expression in mainstream portrayal of these issues, um, especially the peculiarity of how it transpires in Nigeria. And that's what sin is about. Action! The presiding judge at the arraignment of multi million millionaire businessman Olajide Shino earlier today denied him bail and remanded him into the custody of the DLA under, until the trial that is set. That's fine. Everybody knows what this guy said. When I picked up the script, um, I, I wasn't very uh, the title with the title. I wasn't very impressed with with the title that I saw, and I just thought it was going to be one of them religious, you know, storylines. But it was reading the first two or three scenes just got me really, really neck deep into the entire thing, and I finished it in, in one full sweep.